matching a weather service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Del Norte County in Northwest California until 7.30 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. At 6.45 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a severe thunderstorm 10 miles northeast near Casket or 12 miles near Darling Tanya, moving west at 30 miles an hour. Other locations in the warned area include... Milk! <laughs> the following message is transmitted at the request of Del North County Emergency Management. At 6.50 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, reports of the severe thunderstorm approaching Crescent City have been confirmed to be an anomalous thunderstorm. The storm contains radioactive materials. These materials are considered to be deadly. Exposure to these materials would cause serious injuries and possibly death. The storm is expected to arrive in Crescent City at around 7.15 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Evacuation orders have been authorized for Crescent City. Contact your local authorities or dial 911 for more information for evacuation. The BBC has interrupted its normal programming due to a national emergency broadcast. Please stand by and await further information. The BBC has interrupted its normal programming due to a national emergency broadcast. Please stand by and await further information.
the BBC has interrupted its normal programming due to a national emergency broadcast. Please stand by and await further information. The BBC has interrupted its programming at the request of Her Majesty's Government. The current threat level is emergency, meaning you should take immediate action to protect life and property. At 8.45 p.m. local time, the British Health and Safety Executive released a bulletin stating a disease that has mutated from radiation sickness, known as the magenta flu. Symptoms of possible exposure to the magenta flu include, but may not be limited to, coughing, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, hallucinations, homicidal thoughts, loss of control of limbs, and bleeding. Due to the suddenness of the event, there is no known cure at this moment. The United Kingdom is under martial law. Residents are ordered to stay indoors. Leave your home, and you will be arrested and executed. This is to prevent the spread of the magenta flu. Although these guidelines may sound erratic, it is our only available course of action at this time. You should now begin gathering important supplies to last you a minimum of five days. These include food, water, clothing, first aid kit, torches with extra batteries, a battery powered or hand crank radio, medicine, and citizenship. <laughs> Due to an ongoing civil emergency in the Fresno metropolitan area, the weekly test of the NOAA weather radio alarm for May 11, 2022 has been canceled. The Fresno Police Department will be requesting an activation of the emergency alert system within the next few minutes and will explain all details. Remain tuned to KIH 62 or WXL 89 for this information. emergency message requested by the Fresno Police Department as of 7.18 a.m. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Fresno Police Department. The Fresno Police Department has given a shelter-in-place order for any residents in the Fresno Clovis metropolitan area. As of 7.06 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time, emergency management and civilians have reported unusual pink structures of up to 500 feet, usually styled like a skyscraper being built without any notice. These structures have been found to have radioactive substances being poured from the windows that can be deadly as physical contact comes within the substance. A shelter-in-place order has been given. Close all windows and doors, shut off all fireplaces, seal your windows with damp towels, clothing, or tape, and turn off all air conditioning units. Anybody outdoors should seek their nearest indoor building that is not the color pink. Remain tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, AM FM Radio, or television for more updates or an all clear message. This is a civil emergency message requested by the Fresno Police Department as of 7.18 a.m. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Fresno Police Department. The Fresno Police Department has given a shelter-in-place order for any residents in the Fresno Clovis metropolitan area. As of 7.06 a.m. Pacific Daylight. You are listening to All Hazards NOAA Weather Radio Station KIH-62, operating on a frequency of 162.40 MHz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service Forecast Office in Hanford, California. 
with transmission facilities located east of Fresno. The National Weather Service is your official source for weather information and warnings for the central San Joaquin Valley and adjacent portions of the southern Sierra Nevada. For additional information, please visit our website at weather.gov forward slash Henford. Our public service phone number is area code 559-584-3752. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Fresno Police Department. Pink radiological smoke particles have been reported across the San Joaquin Valley area. Cities reporting these radiological particles include Fresno, Bakersfield, Stockton, Clovis, Modesto, and Visalia. All residents in the San Joaquin Valley area are strongly advised to evacuate the area immediately. While evacuating, Gather essential supplies such as food, water, medicines and a battery-powered or hand-crank radio with extra batteries, specifically one with a no-weather radio band. Before evacuating, tie a bright-colored towel to a visible place such as a mailbox or doorstep. This will allow authorities that you are urged about this situation. If you choose not to evacuate, you may be putting your life in extreme danger. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio commercial radio and television, and other media sources for the latest information on this situation. You are listening to All Hazards NOAA Weather Radio Station KIH-62, operating on a frequency of 162.40 MHz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service Forecast Office in Hanford, California, with transmission facilities located east of Fresno. The National Weather Service is your official source for weather information and warnings for the central San Joaquin Valley and adjacent portions of the southern Sierra Nevada. For additional information, please visit our website at weather.gov forward slant Hanford. Our public service phone number is area code 559-584-3752. Service has issued a flash flood warning for eastern Madera County in Central California, northeastern Fresno County in Central California until 6 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. 
At 4.45 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Up to two inches of rain has already fallen. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar indicated. Impact, flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other drainage and low-lying areas. Flash flooding will remain over mainly rural areas of eastern Madera and northeastern Fresno counties. Flooding is occurring or is imminent. It is important to know where you are relative to streams, rivers, or creeks which can become killers in heavy rains. Campers and hikers should avoid streams or creeks. A flash flood warning means that flooding is imminent or occurring. If you are in a warned area, move to higher ground immediately. Residents living along streams and creeks should take immediate precautions to protect life and property. The National Weather Service has issued a flash flood warning for Eastern Madera County. Why are we making such a big deal? Because at Raymore and Flanagan, everything is on sale. Save 33% on this modern Kate sofa. Save 20% on the Emory five-piece dining set. And save 32% on this Belize bedroom set. Save up to 33% on select mattresses. Save even bigger with an...
The following message is transmitted at the request of the emergency management agencies of Fresno and Madera counties. A civil danger warning has been issued due to multiple large wildfires located within the just mentioned counties. In addition to extremely dangerous wildfires, radioactive materials have been released into the atmosphere as a result of these fires, and it has been deemed too dangerous to venture outdoors at this time. Therefore, a shelter-in-place order has been issued for areas not impacted by wildfires. If your area is being threatened by wildfires, you are asked to evacuate immediately. Take food and water for 14 days, clothing for 14 days, medication, a first aid kit, a flashlight, and a radio operated by batteries with you during your evacuation route. Cover all exposed skin with clothing when going outside, and wear a gas mask rated NBC or CBRN to prevent radioactive chemicals from entering your body. Stay tuned to local media outlets for more updates on this developing situation. And Doug. Look, they move. A civilian buying a new car. Let's go. Lemu's right. Liberty Mutual could save you money by customizing your car insurance, so you only pay for what you need. Oh, yeah, I've been a customer for years. Huh. Take cover 
in a ditch or other low-lying area, and cover your head with your hands. The National Weather Service in Hanford, California has issued a tornado warning for... Four. Neighbor, State Farm is there. Hey, Dave. Wow. Is that your agent? It's the jingle. Try it. Uh, no. Like a good neighbor. Just say it. 
State Farm is, is there. With the sandwich. Oh, yeah. And the girl from 4E? Oh, and can I get a hot tub? Nice. Find out what else State Farm agents can do for you at Y Agent. Could switching to Geico really save you 15% or more on car insurance? Did the little piggy cry wee, wee, wee all the way home? The civil authorities issued the civil danger warning. Multiple reports have come in that a pink rain has been falling from the sky. This rain is extremely acidic and will burn anyone that gets caught in the rain. This rain is also very radioactive. It has also been reported that blobs have been forming because of this rain. At this time you are advised to shelter in place in your home. To shelter. In place stay indoors. Close all openings to outside and stay hidden from the blobs. Turn off all ventilation, heating and air as well as all your lights. Keep a weapon in reach of you in case these blobs invade your home. Emergency services may not be able to help you at this time due to the roads deteriorating from the radioactive rain. Stay tuned to local news outlets for more on this dangerous situation. The food you love. The kind of deals that make you boogie. Get the food you love with perks from Grub. Grub what you love. Urgent radiological hazard message for the entire state of California. The following message is transmitted at the request of the California Emergency Management Agency. Emergency management has reported pink radioactive blobs. The public has also reported the sky being purple. The pink blobs have been consuming people, as well as releasing toxic chemicals. All residents are urged to shelter in place. It is too dangerous to evacuate. Seek shelter now. This is an extremely life-threatening situation. If these blobs come into your shelter, kill yourself and everyone in your family. It is best to die quickly rather than die painfully. The National Guard will attempt to stop these creatures. This event has been spotted all around California, including every city. Take shelter now. Help is on the way. This is a nuclear power plant warning. 
This is not a drill. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Nebraska Emergency Management Agency. A nuclear power plant warning has been issued for areas within a 50-mile radius of the Cooper Nuclear Station, located in Brownville in the county of Nemaha, Nebraska. A general emergency has been declared at the plant due to a total core meltdown of reactor number one as a result of the MIS radioactive destroying the plant by her materials causing the plant to be damaged as a result. In addition, a power excursion has been reported, which was ignited a huge wildfire across the course as a result. The following actions need to be taken immediately for your safety. If you are currently located in the 50-mile emergency planning zone, evacuate immediately. Should you choose not to evacuate, you will be putting your life in extreme danger. When evacuating, make sure to tie any kind of color of cloth or towel to a door or mailbox to show authorities that you have safely left the area. Do not use the towel if you need assistance. Should you require assistance, emergency management and law enforcement officials will escort you to the nearest pickup point. To prevent exposure from radioactive materials, put on approved gas mask especially 95 or CBRN. Make sure to close and lock all windows, doors, air conditioning systems, close all windows and doors, shut off all gas, and seal all up any cranks on doors and windows with tape or temp towels before you leave your house. Do not pick up any relatives in schools, hospitals, or nursing homes as these facilities have their own procedures and will act on them according. Get the following supplies to last for the duration of this emergency. Food, water, clothing, medical supplies, a flashlight, a first aid kit, a fully charged cell phone, phone chargers, toiletries, pillows, and blankets, toys, important documents, money, your identification card, and radio operating by batteries. Try to take one car per family if possible. If you hear an air aid siren in your area, that means you are in the warned area and need to evacuate for your safety. Local stations will remain on the air to keep track of more information whenever it becomes available, and most importantly in any kind of situation, stay calm. It was demonstrated multiple times that panicking can only escalate the situation only. Repeating, a nuclear power plant warning has been issued for areas within a 50-mile radius of the Cooper Nuclear Station, located in Brownville in the county of Nemaha, Nebraska. A general emergency has been declared at the plant due to a total core meltdown of reactor number one as a result of the MIS radioactive destroying the plant by her materials causing the plant to be damaged as a result. If you haven't evacuated already do so now. Evacuate now. Nuclear power plant warning. This is not a drill. The following message is transmitted at the request of the San Luis Obispo County Emergency Management Agency in conjunction with the emergency management agencies of the following counties. Fresno, Kern, Kings, Madera, Merced, Monterey, San Benito, Santa Barbara, Santa Cruz, Tulare, and Ventura. A general emergency has been declared at the Diablo Canyon Nuclear Power Plant in San Luis Obispo County, California. This is a mandatory evacuation for all residents within a 150-mile radius of the Diablo Canyon nuclear power plant. A catastrophic explosion has occurred in all reactor cores of the plant, causing severe and immediate damage. Unusual pink radioactive smoke from the cooling towers of the plant was also visible after the explosion occurred. This pink smoke has been confirmed to be radioactive materials. Fallout is now spreading across the 150-mile radius zone as a result. In addition, pink glowing puddles of radioactive materials were completely splattered across the vicinity according to safety officials. These pink radioactive materials appear to originate from a dangerous individual, known as Miss Radioactive, who has caused several radioactive rafts on May 11, 2019. An immediate evacuation order is now in effect for the entire county of San Luis Obispo. If you are in a 150-mile radius of the power plant, or you hear an air raid siren in your area, you are in the risk area, and need to evacuate for your safety. Turn off electricity and gas, and do not pick up children or relatives at schools, hospitals, or nursing homes, as these facilities will have their own evacuation procedures. When evacuating, tie a towel to your door or mailbox to let authorities know that you are aware of the situation. 
Do not use the towel if you need assistance. Make sure to have a survival kit with you that includes food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered or hand-cranked radio. Make sure to lock all windows and doors, and turn off all ventilation systems and air conditioners. Cover all cracks and doors in your house with tape, damp clothing, or damp towels. Repeating, a nuclear power plant warning has been issued for San Luis Obispo County and all residents within a 150-mile radius of the Diablo Canyon nuclear power plant. If you have not yet evacuated, do so immediately. Please obey these orders. What's up, everybody? It's SG413 back again with another birthday collab video for Radioactive Girl 00, who's going to be 22. And I just want to say a happy birthday to you. Uh, I did this a year ago, whenever it was your 21st birthday, and why not do another one? I'm sorry I'm doing this so late. It's actually April 30th, um, for whenever I'm actually doing this, but I just didn't have time to do some of the other days because I was actually working, so. Uh, why not do it now than later, otherwise... I wouldn't be able to be in the submission, but yeah, I just want to say happy birthday and keep doing what you're doing. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Until now, SG213 signing out.